Now, in a game of the hot seat, one of the, the great ways to, uh, to get a good score is to focus on improving the strength of the Duncastle team squad. And you do that by buying players. Uh, if you've got the money, that is. Now, we've appointed a manager, and we've taken a look through our squad, and we want to see whether there are some players who could improve the team's performance. And so what we do is we go into the boardroom there, and at any one stage, if there are some players that are on the target list or the shopping list of the manager, you can see them by uh, taking a look at this icon here, clicking on the Buy a Player icon. But just for half a minute, I just want to double check that we've got enough cash in the bank uh, to be able to afford a player if we find somebody who we want. So here's another cool feature of uh, the hot seat just over here by clicking on this uh, pink piggy bank we can take a look at the, the current bank account. Uh, let's do that here. And this brings up a really important screen in the game which tells you at any one stage firstly how much cash Duncastle has got in the bank you can see up here that it's uh, just over one and a half million. Uh, how much the overdraft limit is, so that is the amount that you could uh, loan uh, short term as, uh, as an overdraft, and at the moment we could loan another million pounds. Uh, over here this tells you what rate of interest will be charged on any overdraft you have or uh, bank loans that you have outstanding. And down here uh, there's a table of any bank loans that the club has and you can see that at the start of the game uh, Duncastle has a loan of four and a half million pounds outstanding with a year to go on which it's having to pay 12 and a half pence, 12 and a half percent interest so a really useful screen there and this is the place you come to when you need a bit of cash now okay I'm gonna go take a look see whether I can buy a player so uh, I'm not sure I've really got enough money uh, to buy a, a decent player. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply for a bank loan. Let's do that over here. Apply for loans. And I reckon I need about uh, five million maybe. Let's just have yeah, five and a bit million. And we'll loan that over. Uh, let's pay that back over two years say. And if we click here to apply for that loan. Yep. Good news, the bank managers let us have that loan. There you can see 5.75 million. And we'll pay that back over two years at 12.5% interest. But that's uh, good news because we've now got some more money in the bank. And if I come out of this, I'm going to go take a look at a player that I might want to buy. Okay, now I'm on the lookout for either a midfielder or a defender. So let's take a look. And okay, Tommy, Tommy Hughes the manager has identified five players uh, who he could he could use in the squad let's take a look see what these guys are like Ali Ferguson Scottish midfielder uh, 8.4 million that's quite a lot okay what else have we got here we've got Mike McLean another Scottish midfielder 2.9 million uh, goalkeeper 3.7 a defender 2.2 okay well I guess I could afford those guys I quite like the look of this guy here Mike McLean he looks pretty good an ability of 6 out of 10 so what this tells me is that he is for sale and his existing club uh, value him at 2.9 million and at the moment he's paid 28,000 pounds okay what I'm going to do now is I'm going to make an offer uh, to, uh, to his club to see whether they'll sell him to me and the way I do that is I need to move these two sliders over here so the first thing to do is to decide how much you want to offer the club for the transfer. So by moving the slider, I quite I think I want this guy. So I'm going to I'm going to offer quite a lot. I'm going to offer three three point two million there, above the transfer value, a bit over the asking price, and I'm going to offer him uh, I'm going to offer him twenty nine thirty thousand pounds worth of of wages per week. And let's see whether that's accepted by clicking make offer. Ah, okay. So the green, the green shade uh, says that Mike McLean's agent has accepted the weekly wage. So 30,000 a week, that's fine. But uh, Royal Albion, his existing club, uh, wants some more money. So I've got a chance, I guess, to offer a bit more. Let's raise it up to 
4 million? 4 million. Let's see if that does the trick. Yeah, I've got him. So, Mike McLean, the club has accepted the offer, his agent has accepted the offer, and what you'll now find is that Mike McLean is a Duncastle player. Let's click OK and come back out of there. And uh, we could check the bank. We'll see that the money has gone down. Let's just go have a look here on the, uh, on the decision tracker. Come back, decision tracker. And uh, where is it? There we are. Bought Mike McLean from Royal Albion for just over four million pounds. And if we take a look on the uh, the bank statement, we'll probably see that that uh, payment's gone out as well. Let's have a look. Yeah, there we are. So a payment out. So we, after we took out the bank loan, we had seven point four million, but four million has gone out for a player. And let's hope that he does the business on the pitch.